there is a 144-floor silo underground that where the humans live in the post-apocalypse. The silo was the last resort of the humans when their air became unbreathable. They have cameras to the outside world, and men in rubber suits clean them. Without fail, the cleaners die, one by one, but even though the cleaners all say they won't go up to the surface to do their job, when the time comes, they always follow through and clean until the air kills them. Holston is a sheriff in the silo, but after his wife discovers forbidden documents that suggest that the world is actual still a lush paradise, she leaves him to be a cleaner. She never comes back, so three years later, Holston signs up to be a cleaner. He goes to the surface and realizes it is paradise, so he removes his helmet and learns suddenly that the helmet was specially designed to make the earth look better than it was, so when he removes the helmet, he chokes on the poisoned air and falls dead, right next to his wife. The mayor and deputy of the silo work together to recruit a new sheriff. They have their eyes set on Juliet, a mechanic. When they agree to offer her vacation time to fix the silo's machinery, she agrees to take the job as sheriff for them. Bernard Holland, head of silo IT, is furious when he learns that a mechanic has been chosen as sheriff, so he poisons the female mayor, and the deputy, who secretly loved her, kills himself in grief. Juliet is now the only authority in the silo. Juliet starts her term as sheriff by investigating Holston's strange and sudden decision to be a cleaner. She flirts with Lucas in IT. As Juliet learns more, Bernard signs her up as a cleaner against her will, just as she discovers that the suits are designed to fail. She also realizes that the screen's visor is showing her a fake reality. But Juliet is surprised when she learns that her suit actually works. She journeys on the surface where she finds a wanderer named Solo, and some wild feral children, and also the remnants of another underground silo where all the humans devolved into violence and killed each other. She finds a radio and communicates with her silo. Her plan is to return to the silo and begin a tunneling project to link the silos so they can use the failed silo's resources. Meanwhile the silo is angry with IT for punishing Juliet, and they plan a coup. The mechanical division of the silo attacks IT and fails. Bernard and IT discovers after the attack that there are 50 silos, built by the humans who were responsible for the environmental catastrophe. Lucas confronts Bernard, having secretly talked to Juliet on the radio, and Bernard sentences him to cleaning on the surface. Juliet figures out a way to save Lucas, but Lucas martyrs himself in a fire. Then Juliet discovers that, actually, no, Lucas is alive. It's Bernard's body in the fire. The silo excommunicated Bernard for his crimes, and Bernard killed himself rather than die of toxicity on the surface. Juliet is elected mayor of her silo.